Hey, welcome to my really quick Arma 3 uniform video. I'm gonna show you all the uniforms and camos the uh, NATO, CSAT and AAF forces use in Arma 3. I'm also gonna be showing you the uh, custom camos uh, Purple Train and Why Not has been working for our little mod pack. So uh, there's a bunch of useful information here for you to use out there in the battlefield. So uh, let's get started, shall we? First off, we're gonna start with the NATO forces. Uh, here is a dude, basic rifleman. Uh, as you can see, the NATO uh, camo is uh, basically a one-color, kind of like a piss green or a, or a nicotine yellow kind of thing going on with the uh, Amex rifle. Uh, notice the uh, the details on the helmet, since they uh, th th that's a good thing to uh, or, or good th that's a good way to uh, identify a target on the battlefield. The green color uniform and the uh, helmet, plus the rifle, is the uh, is the way they identify these two. Next, we have the NATO uh, vehicle right here. That's a slammer tank, and you can see the uh, the the camo, so and so, uh, the green tan color going on. Uh, that's uh, consistent with all of the vehicles, hemi trucks, if it's whatever you have. They all uh, all look the same in the camo department. So uh, there you go. Next up we have the CSAT forces. Uh, this is a really easy one to detect on the battlefield. Uh, the helmet is a straight giveaway. It's kind of the mall man helmet. Uh, or, at, or at least I like to call him the mall man because uh, it's, a, it's a really oddly shaped thing with the, uh, with the wire sticking out the back and the, uh, the big, uh, the big uh, air vent on the back. So it's a kind of really easy one to detect. Also you can see the Katiba black rifle on their hand and that's, an, that's another straight giveaway. Also, the camo is kind of kind of darker green kind of thing going on, so that's also uh, really easy to uh, tell apart from the uh, NATO or the AAF forces. Then we have the uh, CSAT uh, vehicle camo right here. You can see the hexagon thing going on over there. That's uh, also the uh, same with all of their vehicles. Uh, if you see that hexagon uh, camo anywhere, you know that's, uh, that's CSAT. So uh, that's another one really easy one to remember. And next up we have the AAF forces dude standing right here. Uh, again, straight giveaways are the helmet and the rifle, uh, plus of course the, uh, the bright greenish camo they are wearing. And uh, really easy to uh, to tell apart from the CSAT or uh, NATO forces out there in the battlefield. Uh, can't remember the uh, the name of the rifle right now, but uh, it uh, kind of looks like the Katiba, but uh, it's not that dark, so uh, pretty easy to uh, tell apart from. And then we have the uh, AAF uh, vehicle, uh, which has the uh, what I like to call the Minecraft camo, which looks like the something came, you know, the texture looks something that came from Minecraft. Big blocky kind of bright green thing going on. Really easy to tell apart from uh, CSAT or even from the NATO forces camo. And uh, of course they uh, they have the uh, more like a recent kind of armor and vehicles going on. So it's also. Uh, kind of easy to tell apart from, uh, especially from CSAT, CSAT vehicles. So yeah, there we go, that's AAF. And next up, finally, I'm gonna show you the uh, ACW custom uniforms Why Not and Drain has been doing for us. So uh, here we go, three camos they have done, so uh, here they are. There we go. I know this was a really quick rundown of the uniforms and camos, but I think uh, they're not really that hard to identify once you got the knack of them and uh, you know know what things to look for. So uh, there we go. Hopefully this will help to uh, identify a friend from foe out in the battlefield. So uh, see you there.